know Springfield Armors made a couple of 1911s in their day. In fact, one of their, their best-selling puzzles of all time is called the Range Officer. Well, this week we're probably part of the rollout of the new Range Officer Elite. So with the Range Officer Elite, there's four new models of pistols that actually come in 9mm or 45, which makes a total of eight. So any of these four are available in 9mm or 45 ACP. The two that we picked here for our review this week are the new Range Officer Elite Operator and the new Range Officer Compact. For the Range Officer Elite Operator model, here, we we'll the 9mm because I haven't shot that many 1911s in 9mm. So first thing you're going to notice when you open the box in this thing, when I first saw that they came in a cardboard box, I was like, are you, are you kidding me, Springfield? Uh, but it turns out there was actually some, uh, some method to this madness. So in the box, you're going to see this range bag. It comes with a holster double mag carrier, pistol lock, some spare fiber optics and a, uh, a sight tool, cleaning brush, and four magazines. For the compact, we went with a 45 ACP. But it comes with all the same bells and whistles. So the operator model comes with an accessory rail here on the bottom. It's actually Picatinny, which is pretty fantastic in my opinion. Uh, that's long been one of the weaknesses of a 1911 uh, for a duty gun, was there's no ability to attach a flashlight to it without some Rube Goldberg screws and widgets and stuff. But the, uh, the operator model does come with a rail system on it. All the guns in the series also feature an ambidextrous safety. Right. Springfield Armory's lightweight or D-cut hammer. They have these new uh, thin G10 scales. And Springfield Armory's new 2.0 trigger for their 1911 system. So as you can see, we've got a rail here. <coughs> we've got white dots in the rear fiber optic in the front. This is the same throughout the uh, Range Officer Elite line. <coughs> have these uh, thinner G10 scales and the new 2.0 skeletonized trigger. One thing you're going to notice as soon as you pull these out of the box is actually how big the ledge is on the back of these sights. All right, these were meant to be used for one-hand manipulations, and that's not going to be a problem. The compact size model actually features a bull barrel, you can see here, and inside it's got a dual recoil spring. So both these guns are supposed to feature match grade barrels. I'm sure the 1911 fanboys are already happy, but there's only one question left for me. They look great, but how do they shoot? And that's all that really matters. Well, let's go to the range and find out. All right, the first question, as always, is how does it shoot? So for our 9mm full-size operator, we're going to be using uh, Free Munitions 124 grain. And for our 45 ACP uh, compact size, we'll be using Free Munitions 230 grain remake. So let's see how these things do. Oh, I almost forgot about a single stack. <laughs> 